I'm Zach Litton. I'm the VP of Engineering at uh, Telltale Games. Let's start by talking a little about Telltale. You guys are very well known for episodic gaming. Talk a little about some of your franchises. Uh, well, obviously, Borderlands is uh, the one right behind me and is a very big one we just launched uh, last year and are working on Game of Thrones as well as uh, our announcement about a Minecraft game coming later this year. Talk a little about the philosophy and what separates what you guys are doing in video games from others. Uh, well, with the episodic development, we, we definitely need to get episodes out really quickly. So we're always kind of building our technology and pipelines and systems to run on new platforms and then get there as quickly and easily as possible. So one of those new platforms you guys are going to be supporting is the NVIDIA Shield. Talk a little about how you've worked with NVIDIA. So, you know, we basically get as, uh, as early as we can access to those and uh, basically just get our games up and running really quickly. Uh, the NVIDIA platform uh, running kind of based off Android is really easy to kind of get up and running quickly and um, just kind of getting the best content we can on there. How have you guys uh, been able to utilize the Tegra K1 technology that powers that new Shield tablet? Uh, well, what's really exciting is it's uh, it's so much more powerful compared to a lot of existing uh, mobile uh, bases that we can kind of bring in a lot of higher end features that we've been using primarily on the new consoles onto those platforms. So, you know, higher textures, nicer shadows, just really a, a better experience. Can you talk specifically about, let's let's start with uh, Tales from the Borderlands because it's right behind you. Yeah, well, in Borderlands in particular, you know, being able to use kind of the, the full uh, size texture packs, um, you know, being able to get kind of the highest in music, uh, all of the all of the uh, highest quality animations, you know, a system that's capable of running all that uh, just makes the game run a lot nicer. What are your thoughts about how quickly mobile seems to have grown in uh, just from a sheer processing power? Uh, it's it's great. I mean, you know, it's a it's a really important place that uh, for consumers to get content. It's really easy to to jump right in and start playing. So uh, the fact that that's kind of ballooned is is great. You know, as as a marketplace and as a way to uh, experience Telltale Games kind of you know anywhere you want on your couch or you know as you travel anything. The other uh, migration we're seeing is kind of a full circle effect here. We've, we've got mobile and then we've got mobile now connected back to the television, you know, with something like the NVIDIA Shield. What are your thoughts about that new revolution of playing mobile on your big screen TV? Uh, you know, I think it's it's just about seamlessness, right? It's that I can play in my backyard and on the big screen TV and as I travel on the mobile. And, uh, you know, our experiences, because they are kind of, you know, a little a little set two hour, uh, like a little window into the show is great if you can play those on your big screen TV, because that's where you're used to consuming narrative content. Can you give us a sense of how you guys work with different companies? For example, uh, you know, Gearbox was behind Borderlands originally or HBO behind Game of Thrones to bring these games to life episodically. Uh, well, you know, we're just lucky to work with great partners, and I mean, you know, it's always a unique collaboration with whoever we're working at, and uh, you know, just kind of bringing what Telltale does to some of these great IPs. What is it that you feel kind of solidifies what you do or separates what you do from anyone else out there? Uh, you know, the episodes come out very quickly, and they get they get to people, and they they really get a great narrative experience, and um, and I think that's still pretty unique in the industry to be able to come out with episodes at such a you know regular cadence, and to uh, you know have a story in each one of them that you're experiencing, and and that's you know it's great for what Telltale's doing. When it comes to releasing those things episodically, what does that open up in getting immediate fan feedback that could impact what you guys are doing as you go for future episodes or future seasons? Uh, well, yeah, of course, we're, we're always looking at how the fans are reacting, looking at how people are playing our games. I mean, I think the, the things we show at the end where here's your choices compared to everyone else is just a great example of, you know, it's really obvious to everyone how people are walking through our games. And obviously that's a great way for us to know uh, what people are doing and how they're experiencing it and can, can color how we build our games. We've talked about uh, some of your games already, but one that we left out is The Walking Dead. Uh, you know, what role has that played? What have you learned from that franchise that you've applied to everything else since? Uh, you know, Walking Dead was was really drama, like really high drama, and that was great to to bring into the studio and just kind of have that that skill set and the and the talent to to bring those really dramatic moments to to games that um, you know it's kind of hard to get when you're when you don't have it so directed. So so bringing that was was great coming from some of our past that had uh, both drama and comedy and everything to to really focus on it. What did having Robert Workman, Kirkman work with you on that? 
bring to that franchise? Well, obviously he's he's uh, he's the best. He does awesome stuff with the with the comics and the shows. So anytime you can partner with great licenses, they're they're always going to bring to the table, you know, their own creative energy and their own, uh, you know, fans and experiences. It's awesome.